Hi, it's Haley, and I'm back with a new poem. Um, this poem is called Why, and it's about the fear that I see my family and friends live with every single day, and it blocks them from reaching their full potential or even doing something that could like completely change their lives. And it just hurts and breaks my heart to see someone not live because of fear. So I wrote a poem about it. Here we go. Why? Why do we let fear control us? It determines our everyday life. We lose all of our trust and because of what? The media makes a big fuss and it gets inside of our heads, makes us feel like we have to run? That's not okay. I know my God will keep us safe. Fear is of the enemy, so stop running his race. Matthew 6, 26, God says something like this. See the birds? I provide them everything and you have much, much more value. So why worry about anything? If God will protect and feed the birds, then why do we worry if we will be okay? It's just absurd. Worry and fear go hand in hand. In fact, worry is what starts fear. You start to worry about different situations and then fear comes in saying, you're not safe, which is the enemy lying straight to your face. If you have a mustard seed of faith, then trust in our God, he will keep you safe. Even if you don't believe, he'll prove it to you. Just wait and see. Now can we stop with the fear and start living our lives? This doesn't mean you have to fight in the frontier. It just means you shouldn't let fear be your demise. If you're in a constant state of worry, are you even alive? Fear can distract you from what's right and you have so much meaning to your life. And this fear will block that out, force you to hide instead of using your voice to shout. Every single one of you have a purpose, but it's hard to see that when you let fear say you're worthless, which you're not. You can make the decision to step out of fear. I'm not saying it'll be easy. You may even shed a few tears, but it will be relieving to not be the enemy's volunteer. Please let this soak in and please understand how much you are worth. Everything will work out in the end. You just have to trust in our God. This is your new life, a rebirth. Thanks for watching.